Hi there and welcome to Stephen Shelley's DIY and this is today's project. We're going to make this headboard that you can fit onto a pallet bed. For the start of this project you need some plywood. We're going to use a plywood that's 160 centimetres wide, the height's 60 centimetres and it's two centimetres thick. And first of all we've got to round the edges off the top two edges of the board then we're going to sand the edges and once that's done we're going to drill um, two times five lots of holes in there where we're actually going to drill holes in so then we can pull button put buttons on and pull the buttons through to the back so it gives it a nice quilting effect <laughs> I'm going to take the spray glue, I'm going to spray glue all over it so that I can attach the foam to it. I'm then going to, the foam's a little bit bigger so then I've got to cut off the rest of the foam and I've just got to round the edges off. Once that's done, I've got some padding here. That's the fire protective padding so then I can take it and I'm going to cover the whole lot with this fire protecting padding. I'm going to uh, staple the padding into position. We've placed the headboard on top of the material now. I'm going to cut the material out. You have to remember you need the thickness of the material plus at, plus at least 10 centimetres over the top. So I'm just going to cut it out more or less so that I know I've just hold it up and had a look. So I need to cut it off around here. So I'm just going to cut it off roughly and then I'm going to staple the material onto the board. The headboard is now ready to have its buttons attached. These buttons I've made myself out of the material and if you want to see how then they are made then take a look at this video up here. We've got 10 buttons to go on, the holes are in at the back so we have a special needle, this is a button tufting needle. Um, also the thread is a special uh, button thread extra for upholstery. A 
now to finish off the headboard we have to attach these three pieces of wood on the back of the headboard so that we can fix it to the pallet bed. We have to allow at the bottom a space of 18 centimetres and 15 centimetres, 18 centimetres for the flat mattress and 15 centimetres for the pallet and they're going to be screwed on equally wide apart and then we can attach it to the pallet bed. <laughs> And here's the finished headboard and I hope now that my daughter sends me a picture when it's attached to the pallet and if she has it will be at the end of this film so you'll be able to say see it so stay to the end to see if she's attached it to her headboard and other than that don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you in a couple of weeks time ciao ciao